Match between consumers and four drivers behind the lines in three, two, one, go. It's round one, match two, here on the DT Foundation Field, where we have both alliances starting off strong and autonomous. The Hammerheads going back up onto the charge pad for the Red Alliance, and 1506 for the Blue Alliance, both balancing successfully in this autonomous period. And now that the teleoperated period has begun, we immediately see Team 1506 Metal Muscle out of Kettering University bringing one of the purple cubes onto the highest platform for the Blue Alliance grid. While on the Red Alliance, we have the Steel Armadillos and Team 51, the Wings of Fire, simultaneously gaining their link for the Red Alliance. The Red Alliance having two links and the Blue Alliance having one link. Team 51 with a cone in hand, again with the Steel Armadillos of the Red Alliance and their alliance partner 226 with the cube, simultaneously pushing these game pieces onto the Red Alliance grid. While Team 217, the Thunder Chickens, going from the Blue Alliance loading zone over to the Blue Alliance grid as their alliance partners are catching more game pieces. The Thunder Chickens place one onto the grid, successfully claiming another link for the Blue Alliance. Team 217 going back over to the Human Player loading station with all Blue Alliance members as the Steel Armadillos go back in for another cube score with a little over a minute remaining in this round one match. 1506 going to a low node for the Blue Alliance simultaneously with all of their alliance partners completing a cycle and getting another link. Ford and Consumers are both tied, but the Red Alliance did get another link. The Red Alliance has seven links now and the Blue has five with 45 seconds remaining. Team 51 going to the low node again with another cone score. Steel Armadillos with another cone score. While on the Blue Alliance, Waylon Wildcats going to the hybrid zone with a cone. And there are less than 30 seconds remaining in this match and it's so close. Both alliances have seven links each, but the Consumers Energy Alliance is leading against the Red Alliance. As we have three Red Alliance robots simultaneously charging the charge pad with the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance is up, and the Blue Alliance with five seconds left. In three, the Blue Alliance is up in the last second of this match. The score of 191 to 181, sending the Ford Field Blue Alliance to the lower bracket and keeping the Consumers Energy Field Alliance in the upper bracket.